Hey guys, this is uh, Bertram Brandon right here. Uh, today I'm going to do something really very different. I'm going to actually teach you how to jailbreak your iPhone. And before we get started, uh, I'm going to share with you some details before we proceed. Okay, firstly you need an iPhone, you need to update it up to 4.3.2 and um, basically I'm going to use Red Snow as an anti dirt version. It just came out um, not too long ago or maybe a few days ago. Uh, but whatever it is, uh, it worked for quite a lot of other people that I told them about and uh, it worked for me and uh, basically well so let's get started so you're bringing an iPhone alright uh, basically uh, right now uh, let me just let me show you right now I have iTunes I'm opening iTunes or oh, I'm using a Mac system by the way uh, basically see, uh, my iPhone is already connected um, so let's wait for the iPhone to come up once the iPhone screen comes up we're able to see that it's 4.3.2 can see it's 4.3.2 all right so now um, let's proceed with the jailbreaking all right um, right now I actually downloaded a red snow as you can see it's a red snow right here um, the links will be placed below in the description once I open red snow I'll be asked to click on browse right before I click browse I need to download the IPSW version of 4.3.2 which also be placed in the link right below in the description so before that you can see that I have already downloaded this uh, folder here it's the iPhone 4.3.2 sorry the 4.3.2 um, IPSW file so once I have that on my desktop, I'll have to, I'll just go back on the red snow and I'll just click on my desktop and there we go, in the file, and I'll click open. Once I'm that done, um, it will be processing the firmware and uh, once it says it's successfully identified, I'll click next and I'll be processing the kernel and everything. So basically, um, it will just carry on all the way until you go to ask you to put it into a DFU mode. But before that, you'll be seeing this screen, so you want to click on install CD and then follow on by next. I've already actually jailbroken my iPhone, so I would not really click next, but if it is it, it, it definitely 100% guaranteed that it might work. For you, so once you the moment you click next, um, basically it will load onto your iPhone. It will ask you to switch off your iPhone and make sure it's plugged in. And uh, after that, you click next, and it'll guide you in the steps of holding the power on button for five seconds, followed by um, followed by the home button for about ten seconds, and release the home bu uh, power button, holding the home button, and um, basically it will do the best for you. And um, that's how the jailbreak will work for you. So. Um, so you're breaking your iPhone here you go so so that was kind of the tutorial which I will how to jailbreak your iPhone for 4.3.2 uh, right now it does not work I repeat it does not work for iPad 2 yet but for the other uh, iPhone um, particularly it worked for iPhone 4 and uh, I'm not too sure about 3GS and 3G but uh, I think it might work since iPhone 4 might work so anyway um, basically um, and what you can see I was using a Mac system but I have also included the links below um, for Windows and and the other download links for the IPSW files, iTunes, or or even it's known for Mac and it's known for Windows. So basically, um, that's the tutorial for you. And uh, if you got any comments, you can just comment below. If you have any problems, you can try to uh, comment, and I'll try to respond to you as soon as possible. So, well, hope to, hope you all the best in your uh, jailbreaking, and uh, I'll see you soon. Cheers.